Over to Sir William Mark Tully. Uh, good afternoon, uh, ladies and gentlemen. First of all, I'd like to pay tribute to Sri Kanoriaji for uh, organizing and allowing us to have this session. Uh, the session um, is, uh, came out of an idea which we discussed in Delhi with Sri Kanoriaji. Um, uh, I and Ram, Go Ram Gopal Agarwal, as members of Pile, Up, Pile India, whose uh, logo you can see up there. Um, I don't want to say much. I, I'm here to sort of moderate. But the point of this session is that uh, we believe that there's a crisis facing all humanity, a crisis which is not being coped with by politicians, a crisis which has been mentioned in by many of the speakers of your, you've already heard, the crisis of climate change and the environment. And we believe uh, that this crisis is one which the faith community's voices should be heard much more loudly. And we believe those voices will only be heard loudly if the faith communities can speak together on the issues, and particularly on the issue of lifestyle change. And I just want to believe, uh, to read for you a brief extract uh, from a remarkable book by the distinguished Indian writer Amitav Ghosh, who comes from Calcutta, of course. And the title is The Great Derangement, Climate Change and the Unthinkable. And the point of the book is that we must be deranged if we're doing nothing like climate change. And he says, the most pri uh, promising development in the environment movement is the growing involvement of religious groups and leaders in the politics of climate change. If the securitization and corporatization of climate change is to be prevented, then already existing communities and mass, mass organizations will have to be in the forefront of the struggle. And this is a key point. And of such organizations, those with religious affiliation possess the ability to mobilize people in far greater numbers than any others. So in order to, in a way, perhaps launch a search for that common voice, which religious communities could speak in. Um, we have, we're going to have this uh, discussion um, here now. Uh, and we have with us, we're very lucky indeed, uh, sitting on my right, His Holiness Puja Swami Chidanandan and Sadvi Bhagwati Saraswati Ji. Uh, and then on the other side, uh, we have Father Francis, Francis Gonzalez, who will speak of the Christian tradition, and Dr. Aslam Parvez, who will speak of the Islamic tradition. And then at the end of it all, Ram Gopal um, will uh, sum up. 